What's up guys, Dilmix here, and today I'm talking about Timefall on the 360. Now, it just dropped, yeah, it just dropped today, I believe, and, you know, it doesn't look that bad. It doesn't look bad at all. I think, you know, I think this is all a scam. Putting it out there, I think having the Xbox 360 delayed was all a scam, just for Microsoft or whatever, just to get those Xbox One sales going. You guys know it. I, you know, a lot of y'all know this already, but... It's true, you know, they really want to get the Xbox boosting. It did help, you know, Titanfall did help boost the Xbox One sales. You know, they got, I don't know what the increase was, but it did gain them a lot, of, a lot more purchases. But I still think Titanfall is not enough to get people to get sold on the Xbox One. Got to get rid of Connect. That's that's one thing. And I, I think they got to wait for another Halo game, you know, guys. I think Halo is definitely going to help with the Xbox One sales. Who knows when summer fall drops? I mean, maybe sales will go up and down. We'll see how it goes. You know, some people have birthdays here and there, but like I said, you know, overall, Titanfall 360 isn't that bad of a game. It, it runs smoothly. I just think it's the quality is just you can see you can see the difference in quality. Of course, you know, since uh, uh, Timefall and Xbox One PC have higher resolutions than 360, so I mean, really, if you wanted to get Timefall 360, it's okay if you do. So because it's not. Not much of a difference, honestly. So if you're just all about quality instead of quantity, or well, they're all the same. They all have the same stuff. But if you're all about quality, I guess you can go for the Xbox One. But you know, 360 is not bad. Not a bad pickup, anyway. I'm really liking this. I'm really liking the. Uh, I mean, there's no difference. I was really hoping that that 360 wasn't gonna be as all being as bad. Cause I know there's gonna be a lot of sales for the 360. Cause I know there's still a lot of people out there that have a 360. Don't have an Xbox One, so in my opinion, I really do think you should get a Titanfall 360 if you really wanted to. Save some, save a couple hundred dollars, you know. Why not let it fly? So, like I said, I really do think this is a scam. This is all make believe about oh, they need to get this game right for the 360. That was bullcrap. They just wanted sales for the Xbox One. I understand it's a business. You gotta make money. So, let me just guys think about this about Titanfall being a scam. You know, delaying 360 for like four weeks, five weeks, whatever. I mean, it's it's whatever. It's not a big deal. The game's out now, so we're all happy. And let me know what you guys think about Titanfall 360. If you have it, let me know. Really see if you have any experiences with it. If not, it's okay. Are you going to get it? Maybe? Maybe not? Uh, we'll see. Anyways, like and subscribe for more content on me on Titanfall and other games in general. I'm Dean Alex. I'll see you in the future.